Our top story this midday, Austin firefighters trying to figure out what led to a deadly fire on the city's southeast side. Three people were inside the Tumbleweed Drive duplex when flames ripped through it. This was several hours ago. KV Tina Shively has been at the scene all morning. She joins us now with what firefighters have learned so far. Tina. Well, Brian and Yvonne, still a very busy scene here. Three hours after the fire was first called in, you can see firefighters still on the scene putting out hot spots. The battalion chief here tells me the fire was a very hot and dangerous one. At the height of it, more than 40 men and women were trying to knock the fire down. The call came in just before 8 a.m. Firefighters rushed to the scene, knowing a woman was trapped inside. When they arrived, they found very heavy fire coming from the front door of the home and made a very aggressive attack called Vent Enter search. It's a tactic used in rescue missions. It's something they tell me is very dangerous but necessary. After six minutes of trying to find the 73 year old woman, they did find her and took her outside, but she had already passed away. The woman who made the original 911 calls at the scene, she tells me this scene was very chaotic. My instincts kicked in, and I just, only thing I was thinking about was uh, could somebody please come and help? Just what they said is the lady in the back, and then I just it was just upsetting to see the fire like that, you know, when it's so close to your home, you know. So it, it was just upsetting. <laughs> now, the house is a duplex. The family on the other side was not home this morning when the fire started. However, another four people were hurt in the fire, according to EMS. Two were inside at the time. They are believed to be the victim's husband and son. They had non life threatening injuries and are staying with family members. Now, investigators tell me they still don't know if there were smoke detectors inside, how much damage the fire caused, or how it started. They are able to tell me at this point that they do not believe the fire is suspicious. In Southeast Austin, Tina Shively, KVU News Midday.